Hey, it's like we're gonna more Resident Evil. Uh, yeah, we need to go back down to the basement, but obviously gotta put away the inky ribbons first. Um, oh, yeah, we might need some... A little something, some honest. If we face any zombies, we're probably not gonna come back to this area, so it won't be like necessary to like light them on fire. Let me just tuck that off before I forget while I'm here, because what if I go um, back to the box that I still got one left and I don't got a kerosene nearby, you know? What is happening here with my hair? There we go. Um, but yes, that's what we're doing. Uh, let me keep one health on me. I have shotgun shellies and Kate. Do I go for... I'm kind of thinking the grenade launcher because I have more ammo for that. And also, um... We have a variety of ammo for it, too. Self-defense gun. Do I... I gotta keep it health on me. You know? Maybe I- may, I'm a, uh, I guess I need to pick anything up. Okay, uh, I'm good. <laughs> this is a crazy inventory. Um, but I think we face a boss next? I think. I could be wrong. We need to go down. I'll hop over. I won't forget. That's my thought process, is like, I take the grenade launcher and just launch it with that. Leave me alone. There's still a lot of this up here to explore, though. Like, we still have to figure out the puzzle in the bar. And we also still have to figure out, um... Yes, go down. Um... That B thing. That's something else entirely. I will say, though, before I was recording, uh, I remembered I forgot to put mileage on my time card for last week. It's It hasn't been approved yet, so who even knows if I'll get paid on Friday? Or what's tomorrow's Wednesday? Here's the thing. With some payroll systems, I know you can approve it on like Wednesday and get paid on Thursday because it's literally happened to me before and I've literally been fighting with accounting. It takes like one and a half days of process or something like that. And maybe if you have like advanced, like you get advanced on it. I changed banks and I didn't pick the account that kind of does it. So I get it literally day of. So instead of getting it like sometimes Wednesday nights or like Thursday, I get it like on the day I'm supposed to um, instead of early, which is a pain. When I used to get it early. Um, but I'm like, you know what? It's fine. Did we check all the other rooms? Were we like 100% clear on that? Let's check the map really quick. Eh. What's in the hallway? Hang on, let me go back. What's in the hallway? Dynamite. This hallway there's something? Now, well... Oh! That's a hallway. There's like an urban there or something. It's fine. Whatever. We're good. There's something in here though, for sure. Today off of work, which is nice from my retail job. I gather data on sharks. Um. Oh, look, there's another one. Hey, yo. It's a big fish. Kind of trade up the sack. It's kind of over here. Oh, at least I'm nothing. Perfect. Are you dead? Oh my god, I felt a hair and I thought it was a bug. Let me equip 
What's expendable? Handgun ammo? My controller vibrates. Oh, it's because I'm in the water. It's over here. There's enough power. What in the hell am I supposed to do about it? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Go back up, Jill. There's something shining. do that all over again. I died once again within the first 10 minutes of a part. <sighs> it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. We can just beeline it. You see, it took almost another like five minutes to get back here. Expendable ammo. Oh, I pull this in there and then I shut it off. Yeah, that's the Resident Evil thing right there. Am I gonna get electrocuted? It's toasted. I mean, I got nowhere to go. I gotta go down, right? Ooh, give me that. Oh, gallery key, let's go. We're going back up. Okay, I stocked upon all this ammo for nothing. But it's good to know what to take to be prepared. For the next time around. Ooh, 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 ooh. I watch episode six of the Penguin. Because I work Sundays and a lot of time it's Sunday night, so I don't even get to touch my own football games. Or Penguin. So I retaliate by <laughs> I got Peacock. Because there's like something in like June of this year, 2024. Not to date the video. But where uh, they were doing a promotion, and it was like before the Olympics or whatever. It's like a month before. It was like you pay twenty bucks for the oh, year a peacock. I was like, oh hell yeah, I'll catch my football Olympics and then whatever extra stuff peacock has to offer. Hey, this of the year. It's pretty, that's not a bad deal, you know. That's a great deal actually. And obviously, it's much more after a year. But you know, uh, if we're not coming back down here, let me grab. Ooh, never mind. I'm saying, let me grab the herb, but I'd have to go all the way around backtrack. It's fine. We got plenty of health. I think we'll be okay. Even though, again, like this, you gotta collect everything because ammo and everything is so scarce. Clearly. Um, I think we're Gucci. I'm gonna go back and save it. And then also, um, change up my inventory a little bit because having all those guns and, like, not a book and not like a key or whatever, you know, that's kind of crazy. So we're going to run back and save it really quick. And then we're going to go right there to that door. It's a little back and forth action, but hey. It's Resident Evil. Oh, 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 almost bad. That was almost my life. Bloop. All right, Jill. Oh, 
and then I also gotta save that bullet that I shot at the shark. Yay! Good times, good times. Okay, uh, what do we need? Let me get- I'm gonna take that book out. I think I might need the book here. Let me just- girl, we're gonna need this. We do not need all this. This is insane energy. I'm gonna leave the magnum runs too as well. I'm fine with the ammo that I have, I feel like. I'm gonna take the red book. That might be important here because we did get that here as well. Uh, we have health. Um, crank just in case it doesn't say we're done with it. So kind of keep that on me. Ooh, but I need this. I do need this. I'll put the crank back just in case. Actually, I do need to save it. So let me, <laughs> let me save it really quick. Yes, use the ink grip. I don't know where else we would use Crank. What's up with my saves? Why are they all over the place? Oh, because I opened up, I had four, then I opened up 13, didn't I? Yeah. I remember now. I remember <laughs> explicitly my actions. Okay, uh, I'm gonna put this away. And I need my lighter. And then plus, once we get into the gallery room, we'll get rid of the key so that opens up, up a slot. And if you need a crate, you can always come back. Yay. I think I also forget, after playing like Silent Hill 2, auto saves are a blessing. You know what I mean? And because like that game would auto save, I kind of never feared where my save was. So... Yeah, I still would love to do, like, New Game Plus on Twitch. And I think I'll go live whenever I do play it. I just have no time to be playing it right now. Like, I haven't even finished playing Spider-Man 2 New Game Plus. Not that anybody, like, yeah, discard it. Not that anybody, like, follows me on Twitch. But, like, if I kind of want to, like, have that experience of doing, like, New Game Plus, like, open people um, to view. Okay got hanging ammo that's the not necessarily a good thing we got a lot of it too it's over here yo if I had my knife could I take out the damn bees oh no cuz I don't know what the password is right now do I'm gonna need that Yes, I will. Give me that right now. Oh, wait. Where is it? It's down here. Yeah, it is. Oh, you know what? I think... Okay, yeah. We gotta use this. It wasn't shooting through the door. Oh, look. There's a third door, too. It was... Um... The hole in the wall you use the insecticide. That's what it was. I knew there was, you point something and you aim it at the hole. Guess it'll probably get rid of all the bees. There we go. All right. All for a red herb. I'll pick it up. Maybe I should. Lab equipment, you've never seen this before. Could these have been used for some kind of experiment? It looks like it's a museum, though, so it's weird. over here. What key is this, though? Three! We can go into three rooms. Sweet. Uh, I can't take it. It's fine. It would be nice if I would get all the redders, because that way I could get, like, full health refills. And I'll have to double green it up, but I feel like I'll be okay unless everything goes wrong the rest of the game. We should be fine. Is 
do something right there. Eh, yes, I will. Uh-oh. Oh, uh, no, bathrooms aren't so fun in this game. Rotting wood, too? Oh, yes, give me that. Oh, we need that. I oh, if the root doesn't attack me. I'm okay. All umbrella brand products. I would never. I would never. Do you think they put lead in their makeup? I, thought, I just said that because I was watching a TikTok the other day of a girl who's talking about lead in makeup and testing it. Oh, it's a fun suit. Wait, is this a typewriter? Uh, no. Oh. <laughs> All right, organic chemistry lab experiments. The similarities in the cellular characteristics of the rapidly growing plant infected by the tyrant virus have been reported in previous papers. However, while repeating these experiments, an interesting new fact became clear. We learned that the chemical in the UMB family, UMB number 20, contains a compound that is toxic to the cell of the plants. We have given UMB number 20 a new name, Vigil. If calculations prove correct, when Vigil is applied directly to the root of the plant, the plant entirely should be dead within five seconds. The Vigil can be made by simply mixing the VP and the UMB chemicals in a specific ratio. However, extra care must be taken when handling the UMB chemicals. They have been known to generate toxic gases if mishandled. Um. Uh, we do, we do. I'm gonna take a picture really quick. And then. Ooh, do I dare? Because I record on my phone. No, I'm not going to because I may turn off my phone recording. Uh, do I write? So do I write it down? No, I think I can come back to this. I think I can. Maybe it's UMB, VP, and UMB. So blue and red make dark brown. What? Oh, that makes purple. UMB twenty. It's just figuring out which VP it is, right? I know, which you want to be. Either way, we need to make it dark brown. Uh, let me... Yes, it does. It quite, quite very much does. Is this move? One of these got to move, because it's a little... Highlighted. Not. Oh, I thought it was a suit. It's a hat. Use. What do you mean? All the other books are red. Okay, we got a line with the picture. And use a foot. I'm gonna move the foot to the end. Yes. Maybe not. I mean, everything's lined up pretty well, but the process of it is just so annoying. I think they made it easier. There we go. The thickness of the trees. Uh, let me go ahead and save it, though, if I have to save it. It's just annoying that I have ink ribbons and not an inventory box. I'm just going to keep on me. God, you need to do this. Yes, save. Okay, let's go. Okay. 
So we need to mix the chemical. <laughs> For sure. But how do we do such things? It's not these. Oh, fuck me. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, let me go back. Hang on, let me see. Alright, okay, okay, okay. I need... I feel like I need to write it down. Because I don't think I'm going to remember. My memory... Oof. Okay, I knew the numbers corresponded with the colors of the jars with the symbols. And I knew it was for a puzzle in this room. Into, like, the gallery room. I just don't remember what it was. Okay. Um. My notebook is right there. It's my journal. That's why I journal, but, you know. Ooh, there's still health here. Uh, we can use it. I'm gonna use it. I also have that health right there. Did I not pick that up? Still gonna ink with the zombie. Let me pick this one up. Yeah. Thought I did, but maybe I'm just tripping. Or somewhere else I did. Ah, green and blue. So great. Okay. Green, 3 1. Green is 3 1. So we're talking like a full lash. That's how I'm gonna get it. Green is a full lash. Red, half lash. Green, full, red, half. Orange is no lash. Green, full, red, half. Orange, no. So, green, shit, is it six? Yeah, six, six full lash, five no lash, three half lash, three, five, six, three red, six green, five orange, five orange, is that what it was? I may remember, I may remember. Five orange. Yes, 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 yes. My memory, yay, you still serve me. I feel like my memory would be a lot better if I wasn't just brain dead doing my retail job and I was more like on it. Like I like I, when I do my film job. Because with that girl, I'm on it, on it. So like, I think because it exercises, you know, the muscle a little more. When you, when you are working like your brain and stuff. Versus just retail, it's just so mind numbing. It is so mind numbing. And I'm like, I'm wasting so much time and getting paid so little. This guy's gonna be for like 48 hours one week. I wanna ask one of my like supervisors, like, hey, can I come in like two hours late one day? Because you scheduled me for one of those dates, a 10 hour shift, and 48 hours, that's fixed auto or no fixed overtime. And I'm like, is that even a cool thing? I don't know. Yes, okay. Green, six. Red, three. Orange, five. There we go. I remembered, yay! Okay, and we gotta do some mixy mixy. Something run out on the wall. Jesus Christ. 1 plus 3 equals 4. 4 plus 6 equals 10. 1 plus 6 equals 7. 10 plus 7 equals 17. 17 plus 3 equals 20. I think last time I was just randomly doing this, so this is actually very helpful. 
Are you kidding me? I'm gonna draw the freaking ink ribbons. I don't. I can't drop anything, can I? Damn it. Okay, um. I'm gonna run back to the box. Damn it. I fucking hate this game. Sometimes. I love this game. But when it's like stuff like this, it's kind of frustrating. But it is definitely what makes the game the game. Just have to go over the hill, because even though there was a save point, there was not an item box. Okay. Plus, I think I'm gonna... Oh, well, I don't know if the plant will poison me when I fight it, you know? So I'm thinking about how much health I should take with me. So I'm like, there's red herbs galore. You know, like there's one right before you get into the room. So I think I'm gonna drop off all my health. Oh, and I'm gonna take the lighter away too. I don't need this. I don't need this. I don't need this right now. I don't need this. I already have one on me. Okay, um, I'm gonna put that back. And then I'm gonna kind of stock up on grenade launcher uh, and the grenade launcher ammo and I have two slots open that should be enough oh but I also get the health damn it it's fine or actually whenever I get the thing I don't necessarily need to okay um, let me just leave two slots open I'm gonna go do the chemical mixture. And then, um, kind of run back, circle back, kind of figure out my health situation before I go and I fight the giant plant. It is a lot of back and forth, but that's, it seems like the best way to do it. If I don't have an item box nearby, game, you put me in a sticky situation. Okay. Give me this. Uh, you want to be number three? We'll need one and three. What is this? Yellow six. Yeah, I'll take the empty bottle. Um, got the water. And number three. Okay, then give me this. And then give me this. And then I'm assuming one is water. There, I made purple. Equals four. Four plus six equals ten. Okay, yellow number six. I'll put that in here. Need an orange. Plus four, four plus six equals ten. One plus six equals seven. I need another empty spot. <sighs> or can I not just mix the other numbers? You know what? Instead of me running back, let me go and try and mix the other numbers just into the one I already have. Because I have to make... It's all going to go together anyways. Unless the specific order is anything. Unless I die here. Because I can just do more water and six. Let me just add this. Never mind that I need an empty slot because I need to redo all that over again. 
Wow, you should trust your gut instinct, Erica. Don't try and go around the game. Very secret ways. These games were very linear, very one way to sort of do things. Not all these tricks, all of these cheat codes and these guides. It was a one, one way sort of street. I'm gonna see if I can reload. No. I almost want to cry because of that. I was just like, no, I have to do it again. I don't even know how, how much time it was in me anyways. Maybe I need four slots. I'm going to put the grenade launcher ammo away. Because there's like four bottles. So I just gave myself an extra trip too. Or at least several. Because I came here, I got to go back. And then I got to come here and I got to go back at least one more time. Okay. You are going here. You are going here. You're going here, and I'm gonna unequip the shotgun. That doesn't even matter right now, but. It is what it is. So messed up. Like, I'm going to bed like three or four every morning, which causes me to wake up at like 10 or 11. Even though my dogs wake me up at like seven or eight, I go back to sleep right away because I'm exhausted. Because I keep working night shifts. And I'm like, I don't like the hours with this. I was like, I was trying to tell them, I'm like, well, I like kind of like working during the day because I like kind of being awake during the day because I do other things. I do this. I have my other channel. Um, all right. We need, oh, I didn't need to put all that away, but whatever. I have to go back anyways. Okay. So it's water and yes, water. Let me, let me do two. I already know I need two. So sweet. Okay. Um, one plus three equals four. So give me a four. Yes. And I will combine it here. Four plus six equals ten. And then one plus six. So we both need to do these. Okay. Uh, let me take some more in the other one. So this needs to go here, and this needs to go here. Whatever, same difference, all the same spots. Okay. Um, we just added the six. Ten plus seven equals seventeen. So we need to combine these, and then three equals twenty. There we go. Vigil. Why does it shake like that? Oh my god. No. No. Alright, I have this. This is used to defeat the plant. get myself ready for battle and then we're gonna go into battle it's gonna be great guys it's gonna be great i don't know if to use it on the enemy but i don't know how to use it it's in the basement all right so i gotta go down somehow oh way down. A 
like... Into that one electrical room. I feel like I do. Alright, we'll keep this thing on us. Alright, what do we need? Uh, we're gonna take our grenade launcher for sure. Grenade shells for sure. Uh, health for sure. Preferably that. Let me save it. While we're here. Don't want to redo all that. Let me check the map. Yep. That one room right there in the aqua ring. But I don't know if that's roots or not. Dare we check? I need to check it. I need to make sure that's not what it is. Because there's a part of me that's just like, oh, if we just go into that one room and we fight him and it's fine. Nothing really matters, but if I go and I try to find him and I die, then I have to go back down there anyways. You know, that's kind of like how I'm looking at the outcome. I'm just going to try it. And if it doesn't work, then it doesn't work. I wonder if I did these exact same decisions the last time. I think it's important to like watch yourself to kind of see like what you're doing because like I'm like I kind of know how I like to edit and I like um which is not much and I kind of like that my videos don't necessarily require a lot of editing um but like means we gotta go all the way around too Urg -urg -urg. that's fine so far um But like, what was I saying? That I like videos are edited. I was gonna say something about like my style of videos. Was I? I started going on about it and I just had a brain fart. I don't remember what I was gonna say. I'm so sorry. I can't let go. Here I am y'all already. Oh, wrong way. about like my style of it. I don't even know what I was thinking. I'll be honest. Well, I forgot it. And it's gonna bug me because I think it was something I wanted to say. That's it. 
that there's nothing even fun in here. All right, let me check my inventory really quick, see. I mean, there's... Hold on, do I have my shotgun? I don't, I'm gonna go back and get my shotgun. Very Resident Evil thing to do, go all the way back there. I was, I don't know about editing. And the way I edit. Now I do my videos, it's gonna drive me crazy. I have to keep thinking about it, especially with all the spare time. Going back. I feel like there was something along the lines of like... I don't even know. What was it? I don't even remember. And it's gonna drive me crazy and I'm gonna take a keep talking about it for the next 15 minutes until I just give up or get distracted. Like the time of day that I like day shifts because of like the types of stuff that I do on the side. And I was gonna ask my boss, like, do you think I should just like show up late? Oh, because like the overtime thing, right? And they schedule me for a 10 hour day. I kind of want to give it the 10 hours, but then if I do, that leaves me at 38 and my paycheck is like so small enough, anyways. And I'm just like, you know. Alright, uh, box. Yes, because we're gonna get the shotgun just for safety. Oh yeah, and just, uh, sorry, I didn't finish even the thought that I remembered. Um, that like, I like to do my videos at night and I like it's messing up my sort of thing because like I could like I like it's crazy because like nine hours will take me out we're gonna have uh, retail but I can do 12 like cake it's it's weird but like I guess it's like a lot mental of being like oh I want to be working that 12 hours and that's what I know I'm signing up for versus this I didn't even know it was going to be full-time. I thought it was going to be part-time. And I was like, oh, this is great. I can have time for this. And now a lot of my videos have been late. I've been able to get this game done and finish it. I wanted to do it at the same time as, like, um, I was doing Silent Hill 2. And that plan just, like, did not work. And I knew that doing even two series is just, like, a nightmare. But got bills to pay. And there's like weeks where I'm like scheduled for like six days of work and I'm like, where is my day off? You know what I mean? That's some of them are only like five or six hours of work, so I'm like, okay, I guess that's fine. You know? It's only for just like a few hours every day. That would kill me, but well, it wouldn't kill me, but it'd be hella annoying. Alright, let's go ahead and combine these. Alright, and Ooh, where do we start? Let's start with this. No need to waste time if we don't need to. What the hell is this thing? Where do, where do you have a flamethrower? Jill!
Like, there's a lot of berry action. <sighs> I thought it was finished. Yeah. That was close. I forget who does this. Thanks Chris. again. Don't mention it. I thought I have to fight it. But what was that? What the hell's going on in this place? I totally thought I had to fight that thing. Did I not fight that thing as Chris? Mansion key. What? Is this a Spencer key? Ah, helmet key. We're going back. Sweet. I thought I had to fight that thing. That's why I came stacked. Barry, do you not see my grenade launcher? I was ready. I could have sworn it's Chris. I fought them. It's also a very boss type area as well, but maybe. I don't think the enemies were different depending on who you played. It's pretty much the same thing minus like cutscenes and stuff. Barry. Something about that mansion still bothers me. But I think I'll stay here a little longer. We should split up again and investigate. All right. Jill, why are you so about it, girl? Okay, back we go. Wait, I think I went through the wrong door, didn't I? Is there another door to go through? Apparently not. There's still like a battery for the lift thing that I don't have. Barry. I think I'll stay here a little longer. How many times can I do that? Nope, there's nothing up here then. I don't think anything on the second floor. I'm just like triple checking now at this point. It's a little bit excessive, but I feel like I gotta be fair off. Well, is the room cleared out? Yeah, the room's cleared out. Okay. It, see you later, Barry, I guess. Then why did they give me a red herb? Is it because maybe when you first go through the door that got locked and you go into that room the first time, maybe it's because you get hit? I don't know. Well, I'm going to go back to the box. I'll at least get it back to the mansion. Whenever I get back, I'll probably save it. Wesker? I did not mean to do it at the same time. Jill, so you're safe. That's what I was going to say. I apologize. It was all I could do to protect myself against those strange creatures. I understand. Anyway, it's good that you're safe. Did you notice? Barry, he sounded a little flaky. Now that you mention it, yeah. I'll keep a close eye. Maybe it's quite natural under these circumstances. It's not really our standard operation. Jill, our first priority is to get out of here. I agree. There are still rooms in that mansion we can't get into because they're locked up. I've been looking for ways to... Okay, if there's anything, I'll go back to the other mansion. I'm counting on you. I'm glad that she didn't tell him she has a key. That's a Jill behavior. I'll go back and see if Barry's there. And Wes. Barry's been a little flaky lately. Wow, I've noticed. What if he's gone? He's examining the floor. Okay, we're gonna leave Barry alone then. Alright, we're good. I just had to double check, make sure. Where did Wesker go? Where did he come from? I 
I think it's kind of interesting, like, to play these types of games and see, like, I feel like nowadays a lot of weight is more put on, like, the narrative and that whole experience of it. Well, this one has, like, a very strong narrative, I think. Um, like, extremely good and even, like, all, like, the behind the scenes sort of stuff with just like the mansion and all the documents that you read and sort of explaining all the science of it all. Um, pretty well done. Excellently done, I think. And I think a lot of games could take note from this because versus just kind of like, well, I don't know, Silent Hill 2 just a lot of mystery in general. Um, but like, kind of like how to do the science right. And it's kind of like shocking to me that like, this game kind of did it so well. So why couldn't if the movies were based off of this game, and probably when did, gosh, when did the original Resident Evil 2 come out? I don't even know, but that might have been, uh, do I save it before I go? I'm gonna save it just in case. Um, also going to get this back on me, along with this. And again, I'll probably just get to the mansion and save it over there. But in case we run into anything unfamiliar, I want to sort of be prepared. Yeah, and then I'll see what we can do in the next one. Alright, dropping this. Give me one extra slot to pick anything up. we got with this key. I don't know, back to kind of what I was saying in the beginning about, um, so many blue herbs and so unnecessary. Um, or that I was saying earlier that I forgot with, like, um, working and the hours that they give me and stuff, and it's just, like, it's a thing, man. I better not need the damn crank. Stars Alpha team. Come in. This is Jill. Does anybody hear me? I hear you, Brad. Over. Stars Alpha team. Bravo team. Brad Vickers. It doesn't matter. Respond. I repeat, this is Brad. Brad? Brad. This is Brad. If you can't answer me, somehow give me a sign. Jill to Brad. Can you hear me? Brad. Shit, it's broken. Okay, Jill. Now, do I pick up the red herb? And I already walked through it. You know what? I'm gonna pick it up. I'm gonna pick it up because I have a lot of green, and to be nice, is that crow move? Or the dog. It might be a dog. It'd be nice to not have to combine the green green. Alright, let's go. Oh crap, he's alive. Get over here. Uh, Ow. Uh, okay. Um. Poisoned. God. Damn it. I don't know if I have any blue herbs in my inventory, and I can't. I can't, I need to go back and get a blue herb. This sucks. Also was not able to check out that other area. Let me start a new recording, hang on. Oh, there's one right here. Okay, I'm gonna grab this. 
Oh, I just need to do that. Sweet. I didn't even need a... Okay. Dope. Five Essies. There's the other one with the battery, though, that I don't have. Do I not need to figure that out, or is that something later? Leave me alone. Beeline it, Jill! <clears throat> God damn it. How am I doing now? I know it's over here, isn't it? Yeah. That may be something entirely different. Plus, there's a whole waterfall thing. Ooh, green herb. I mean, I could take it. Get me back to full health. And then just pick up this green one and then have the same health with a less inventory slot. Or one more inventory slot. Because there's still even more of an outdoor section we have not explored yet. I can at least take this. Use these names for yourself keep yourself from that bulletproof thing in chains. I went ahead and fixed that piece of crap door too. <gasps> Barry, you're lovely. Acid shells. Girl, what? Okay, now that he fixed the door, we can go back and forth. Yay, Barry, you're the best. I don't think Chris had this much interaction with Barry. He had more stuff with Wesker, you know. But I think they did that just so you can kind of go back and forth right here. But it's cool that that's not a problem. I avoided it at, like, all costs and it paid off because I was able to go through it once. Um. Shit. Oh, no. Leave me alone. Oh, no, it's these things. <gasps> I forgot these were in this game. Oh, shit. I forgot about these entirely. Oh, my God. They said acid rounds? Oh, I got a lot of their health back there, too. Okay, so I'm going to put away... Shotgun. And I'm going to get the grenade launcher. And I'm going to. There we go. That's how you do that joint. Okay. And I'm going to equip it. And we're going to see how well this works. Did you see how that thing jumps? Ugh. Okay, I think it's good. Uh, my health is low though, but we're gonna go get more health. So it takes two shots, it looks like, to take him down. Hopefully there's only three. That's a hope and a dream. I gotta take him out because I'm gonna be running around the mansion again. Damn it, Jill. All kinds of enemies in this game, it's ridiculous. 
giant spiders, dogs, zombies, those creatures, sharks. It's, girl, they were ambitious back in the day. But again, this is, not all of this was in the original, so. There's that. Pick up the damn health. Damn it, I only freed myself one spot, but it's kind because I'm going to use it. It's kind. It's fine because I'm going to use one right now. And then this will be my um, health that I keep on me. The bad thing is that I only got one acid round left. And if there's another one, which I'm assuming there is, if there was two. I don't even, like, I remember these in three. I vaguely remember them in this game. Okay, uh, hanging for the time being. Oh, we got the helmet key. Let's see what doors are locked. Um, why is that blue? Why is that red? Why are you red out here? I might have to take that later, huh? Okay, well, we need another one for sure. If that's what opens down below, then we're going to need another one. Like I said, I was going to save it and I was going to end the part. So we're back at the mansion. I guess I'm going to uh, save it over here. The door's fixed, yeah. Um, and then we're gonna, next part, we're going to explore with the helmet key. Should be a grand old time. Let's. I'm gonna check the map though and kind of see what areas that includes. Um, we don't have like kerosene here, so that's not necessarily gonna be something I'm gonna worry about. Um, it is what it is, you know. So there's that's a Spencer room, so that doesn't count. There's that room right there, kind of. I can't even. Yard. What are those red sections? I don't want to. This is a bridge. Okay. Interesting. Mansion. There we go. Um, there's then like the lobby area. There's that one, and then there's just like the gate below it. We need to get to. I think that one red thing on the left is the tiger eye. Um, there's obviously all the red marked rooms here on the second floor. Uh, is that third floor one? Yeah, and the basement? Is the basement the helmet key? Huh. All right then, that's some more things we gotta explore in the next part. Um, and I also kinda do like the sort of levels of having to kinda like, kind of like retrace your steps and, um, you know, um, Kind of just like how the game has you like kind of go through the mansion three times with the different keys like entirely i think that's kind of like a cool thing and the sort of different waves of enemies and new types of enemies everything like that i think it's like a pretty cool like level design and it also keeps everything very much tied into the mansion of it being kind of the main or the center location of everything you know what i mean sure you expand you go all these different places but then you also um it's kind of still like the central sort of hub of everything that's happening here. Um, and it's also the central hub of everything that's happening here. Um, if that makes sense. But yes, thank you so, so much for watching. If you did enjoy this, don't forget to do the YouTube things like, share, and subscribe. It really does help out a small channel like mine tremendously when you do decide to show any ounce of support. And I genuinely appreciate any ounce of support you do decide to share with my channel. So thank you so, so much for watching. Love you and I'll see you in part seven. Bye.